All right, Daniel the Adjuster here. I just thought I'd do a quick video showing sometimes we do run into roofs that are a little bit difficult to get on. And this one here is a prime example. Look at this house. It doesn't give us a whole lot of access to get onto, but if you look right here, we're gonna climb up this spot here. We're gonna climb up there, and that peak actually does get to that second level. So a little bit tricky, but we're gonna climb up that edge. It's a 10-12, not a 12-12, so we should be able to do okay. Uh, stick with me as I walk on this roof. Alrighty, so put our ladder right there on the edge attached it to the gutter see my bungee and then I just grabbed onto the edge of the shingles and used that as handles to walk up this slope and then we can get on the ridge and if you look over here I only have one little quick step up to get to the next roof line which then will make it all the way up to the top Okay, well, we made it up to the top. Make sure you take care of looking at that beautiful view while you're up here. You're at the top of the world. It's cold out here, 39 degrees today, but kind of windy. Anyway, so we'll do an overview of the roof and the granule loss on this roof is pretty substantial. We definitely got hail damage on this roof. Very interesting back roof. I haven't seen this in a long time. I hear my crunching. I'm walking on these bridge banks and they're all crunching. But very interesting back porch here, or a dormer window is what this would be considered. Uh, not very often to see a this type of barrel, not barrel, but a, I don't know what you call these things, but <laughs> weird roof. Kind of a strange one, not, not very often. A turret, that's what they're called, turrets. So anyways, let's take a look at the damage. So guys, on the front here, we definitely got some serious hail. Look at these hits. These are massive. Look at my finger. I mean, these are big hits, guys. This, uh, overall, the, the amount of damage on this roof is massive compared to uh, what I was expecting. But here's the thing. It's an old roof and it has lots of granule loss and it basically is just worn out when you've got a roof that's completely worn out it's going to fail to hail significantly it's just not going to be able to handle the hits and so you're just going to see a lot of damage overall the whole roof so this is a quickie easy one guys easy one okay we're back down safe pulled our ladder, dropped it into the car. I wanted to show you what I do here. Typically when I have to draw the roof is do this little sketch. Put all my measurements, my pitches encircled just to do a sketch drawing to let me know how to draw that when I get back to the office. It's an easy way to make sure you get your measurements right. All right guys, thank you so much for joining me on this small little roof quickie <laughs> inspection. Just wanna let you guys know what it's like to get on difficult roofs sometimes, but it's okay, we can do it. And you just take your time, you'll be able to get back down without any problems. So, Daniel the Adjuster, let me know if you have any questions, I'll be sure to help you. We'll see you on the next one, bye-bye.